Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to today's video. It is Run With Brad. And if you didn't know, I'm a PE teacher and the product I'm going to show you today could be a PE teacher's best friend. If you're like me, I like to play sports that involve a ball. And then sometimes when those kickballs or basketballs or footballs are just sitting around, they get deflated and you might be in a pinch and you need a pump. Well, I got the perfect product for you. This is a handheld electric rechargeable pump. I'm going to open it up, show you how it works, see how it works, and we're going to put it to the test. So you don't want to miss it, especially if you're a PE teacher or any kind of sports coach. All right, let's check it out. All right, here's a closer look at the pump. It can't be any bigger than my hands, so it comes with a needle, charging cord. You can get this off of Amazon. I will have the link down in the description. So if you think you could use this, please use that link below. Let's open it up. It's packaged really well, by the way. Right, user manual. Here is the pump. All right, I'm going to have to figure it out. This must be the charging cord right here. So this is what it looks like. All right, so right here, uh, the needles. Are held right there. I guess this got two of them. They're very secure. Looks like we got a deflate and inflate. So we want to inflate. All right, I'm looking at the settings in the manual and it's actually got preset settings in here. You got uh, American football, soccer ball, basketball, and then manual, but it comes with a recommended pressure for each ball. I got the pump cut on and here, whoa, so that's a soccer ball. I mean, so I can adjust the PSI there. You got basketball, manual, We're going to blow up a basketball, so it is recommended at eight. You just hit the button. This is pre-charged. This is without plugging it up yet. Let's see if it cuts off. And if I wanted to deflate it, I guess I could just put it there and easily do that as well so uh, deflating can be um, handy in case you're wanting to pack up some uh, balls that are pumped up and you need to get there out all right let's put it to the test all right so right here i have just a standard rubber basketball that you would play with on the playground and same with a kickball both of these courtesy of the American Heart Association. Let's blow them up and let's see how it does. All right, this is without charging it up, straight out of the box. We're gonna plug it in, or we're gonna put the pump in the basketball, pump it up, and we'll see how fast it does and how, how much it'll pump it up. All right, I got a basketball, I got the pump, I got it set on the basketball setting, and I'm gonna set a timer. We're just gonna see how long it takes to blow up this basketball. All right, got my stopwatch ready. Plug it in right here. And on your mark, get set, go. All right, it's keeping up with the pounds of pressure as it blows the basketball up. We are at 12 seconds right now. We're at 
about one pound of pressure. The goal is eight PSI, so recommended on from the manual. We're halfway there on the PSI, we're a minute 13 seconds. Now this is fresh out of the box, so the battery is probably getting tested here. We're at six PSI. We're gonna to try to get it all the way to eight, but this is not a standard basketball. It feels, it feels pretty blown up. So we're gonna get it all the way to eight just to see how it does. And all right, a minute, 43 seconds. This ball is pumped. Let's see how it bounces. All right, I'd say it bounces pretty good. All right, next up, I'm gonna set it on the soccer settings and I'm going to blow up this kickball. I'm gonna charge it up for a few minutes and then we'll give it another go. All right, the charger is a simple USB type cord. Plugs right in the bottom. And now I'm gonna plug it up. All right, it is charging. We'll let it sit a few minutes. We'll get this thing cranked back up. All right, for some reason it didn't record when I blew up the kickball, so I'm gonna show you how it deflates. So I switched the needle around and I got it on the deflate setting. All right, that is basically all the air, and how I got it. So let's try it again, let's blow it up. I will say when I blew it up, this kickball only took about three pounds, three PSI. So it's not gonna take, it took about a minute and a half to blow it up. I'm gonna show you real quick, I just switched the needle. Another great thing about these uh, ball needles, they are sturdy, they're not gonna bend. I have a standard ball needle right here and then this brass on here is, just makes this needle so much more durable. You can just tell the difference. The thickness of the needle is, is better. So you don't have to worry about it bending and breaking inside the ball, which has happened a ton of times with me. So, all right, let's blow this kickball up. Time it one more time. Again, we're only gonna go for about three PSI. And boom, got it going. at 120, a minute 20 seconds. And this ball is stuffed. It is ready for four square kickball, whatever it is you wanna play with. All right, final thoughts on this. I think this is a great product. I think any PE teacher, coach, teacher, anybody could use this. It is $24.99 on Amazon. I have a link below that you can use. It'll help support me and help support this channel. Let me know what you think in the comments. If you could use this, uh, great thing about it, this box is really, it's a nice box, it's well put together, and this is padded casing inside it, so if you were worried about this breaking, you could always just put it back in the box. Easy storage with the needles, they are like, there's like rubber casing it fits in, so they're, they're not going to slide out. Just hold it down, turn it off, got different settings, and it's pretty awesome. So go check it out. Share the video if you think you know someone who could use this. All right, guys, appreciate you watching. If you would, hit the subscribe button, and we'll see you in the next video. Peace.